The community of Okandundu have tried to fix the broken pipe but find it impossible as the pipe is under a concrete slab which makes it difficult for them to fix. The community alleges that numerous attempts to get the municipality to fix the tap have been unsuccessful as they never turn up. We called the municipality and they are not coming, and the water is running just like that. With the city of Venduk recently hit with a shortage of water and implementing stringent measures to save water, the community is questioning why is it taking them so long to fix their communal tap. Most residents have been living at this area since 1994 and say development has been very slow. Water is not their only problem as they are also faced with challenges of electricity, proper sanitation and air vents. We really want the municipality to help us. The toilets are few and don't even have doors. The water runs sometimes with feces and sometimes we step on it. This can even result in corolla outbreak. Please, we want them to help us with urban and add to our houses because some of us have a lot of kids. And now we are not allowed to take illegal electricity, but till when will you be in the dark? How many years have we been independent now and we are still not provided with basic things? Sanitation has been a serious issue for them with only four toilets in their location shared by over 1,000 people. Residents say this is why the toilets are in their current dilapidated condition. Contacted for comment, Lydia Amutenya, the public relations officer of City of Venduk, said the public sometimes call the wrong numbers. The water interruption team is always ready to immediately attend to any water-related issues, including pipe burst. She further vowed that the water meter will be attended to soon. Amutenya is urging the public to make sure they call the right people for the right municipality services. Water-related issues are to be reported to the City of Venduk's water interruption team with phone numbers available in the telephone directory and on the city's website. Salima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.